between the champ, Niffy, and the challenger, Maka. Winner of this gets the money, comes back next week as the champ. And we have seen Maka really grinding and doing every tournament around, but Niffy remains a big household name. And considering his performance last week, I'm looking forward to see this one. Yep, yep, Nifi definitely the uh, the veteran in this matchup. Uh, Maka sort of like a prodigy. I heard he's like 17. He's super, super young. He's young, yeah. I think uh, he's like 16, 17, yeah. 16, 17. Uh, they always come out of the woodwork. Uh, he's got a lot on his shoulders because someone needs to stop the French being at the top of one. I said yeah. this last week. Someone needs to stop this. Uh, uh, at Maka. the moment, guys, Wanted runs on three games. Guilty Gear, Dragon Ball Fighters, and Street Fighter Five, and all three champions are French. So, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> Gonna have to show him uh, some sort of. I feel the butterfly. This butterfly mix is really strong. There we go. Yeah, because it's gonna force Neefy to make a decision, and Neefy's uh, he's a connoisseur of DP. Like he's he's not afraid to do it, and uh, Maka has shown that he can punish that and get a lot of damage. But good backdash butterfly, and he just gets hit really mad. <laughs> oh, the back blue RC. To avoid that throw, whatever it was, into mm -hmm. the punish tower stick. That is Wook. Wook yeah, wins yeah. the game by Beef, being Wook. Beefy got got by the tech. Uh, that was a regular throw. A slightly different animation on wild throw to a regular throw. Yeah. But either way, the situation would have ended the same no matter what throw he would have done there. Maka on the ball with the first round. And wait, wouldn't, wouldn't BRC also at least get away from a button? Or would you get stuffed by a button? Depending on the button. Okay. If it was like Fire S, it probably would have got away from it. But if it was 6S, I don't know. That button's yeah. kind of wild. Okay. Headbutt. Nifi not deterred from the first round. He said, yeah, spend your bar to get away from my grab butt. Eventually, I'm going to get my grubby mitts on you and good DP for the 12. More 12s. Oh my gosh, Mac is trying to fight his way out of this corner. Nice. That's gonna be quick damage. No burst used yet. I'm gonna go for the throw a bit more in the corner. There's still a burst to activate, and right now it's burst bait time. Oh! That's a good burst. Oh no, he didn't My burst. God, did he burst? No, he did. I no, thought he, he did not. Did. I, forced, I think I he was. I saw the animation. I swear I saw the animation, C4. Same. I definitely thought he was bursting. That was really weird. Uh, I know <laughs> when you go into the super freeze, it locks you out, so you would have had to have done it beforehand. But yeah, that's what I thought he did. Unfortunate. Straight into the next match, though, and pretty much verbatim the last one. Maka finds his way out of the right hand side corner. Beefy not letting up, and good backdash on the far SC, guys. It's just that easy. A 16 year old can do it. Just backdash the button, man. Oh, the back throw. All right, managed to get an escape. It's time for the pressure. Fake fusion into nothing. Nice one. That's gonna get solid damage, but immediate wall. Actually, kind of safe by the wall. Without this, it could have gotten bigger, bigger damage. Yeah, there's a lot of situations where it's actually not too bad just to burst uh, in the corner, even if the burst whips, because you know you're not gonna take a lot of damage because the wall's gonna break. Yeah. Uh, but really good stuff by Nifi to try and mitigate the damage. Makar doesn't care. He's saying, "I'm taking you out anyway." We're going to the canyon. But again, this right-hand corner is getting a lot of screen time today. Ooh, checking in with the peas. Jolly Green Giant stuff. 12 at man. Like, Maka's fundamentals are actually insane. He's so cautious of whiffing throws. He PRCs it whenever he can. Yeah. I really like the way he's very proactive. But in the corner now, he has to deal with this. Pressure and trying. But Niffy is adapting at light speeds. He sees the spinning and immediately changes into a dashing and throw to avoid it. Yeah, he's a... Uh, oh my gosh, the DP... Yeah, the second one will never win. Not when Nifi doesn't. <laughs> oh my gosh, the third one... You know, can't the, you know the, the, the second one would have a hit right now, but Nifi decided yeah. to backdash, he was nice enough. <laughs> he's definitely playing some like ST Ken stuff where like the, the DP's plus on with. He, he doesn't care. <laughs> uh, it, obviously, like it is punishable. It's not easy to do, but it is punishable. Uh, Mac is going to have to adapt a little bit, maybe give up some damage and use like a, a quicker, weaker button to punish it. Oh my gosh. PP into 6H. Oh no, it's fine. And again. Yeah. She's getting just small and small damage on this. You're going to have to burst, mate. Oh, there we go. That was like, I mean, at this point, it was pretty much checkmate because you have to burst. You got burst. 
You got to use something. Not gonna work. Niffy with the dominant first two games. Yeah, uh, I think the only thing that Maka can do is he's getting clipped by that move, the success. Really sick command number that Souls got. He never had it before. Uh, I'm not sure if you can low profile it. Maybe something like a preemptive 2D just to control the space. Uh, JK, he just tried it, it didn't work. So, what do I know? Back to lab for me. <laughs> Big damage. Not kidding just yet. Counter. Let's go. Can Maka get something going? Wow. Back is brave, man. He's seen Nifi DP literally, what, like five times a game? And he's trying to hit him with tap taps with two Ps. <sighs> yeah, you. So, far S, if you backdash that, if you press a button and the soul goes to 5H, you kind of just lose. <laughs> yeah. You have to have like a very specific button to beat the 5H afterwards. It's not as strong, I would say, as the 5S and the 6S, but yeah, look what it does when it does connect. Insane damage. Ooh. Ooh, good 6P. Oh, good you know dragon punch. Even, even better DP. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> even better. Don't you wish you had a DP like this? Oh, Tokyo drifts everywhere. Back up, comes out on top. Yeah, he's trying his darndest to stay out of 6S range, but yeah. it's so hard because it's so, so quick. <laughs> Listen, C4, this, this, is, this, is, this might be a Street Fighter player thing to say, but like, I find it very crazy that that 6S has literally zero recovery on Whiff. <laughs> like, the fact it's, that he can literally do yeah. success into success and no matter why I press, I will never whiff for this shit. And if I will, DP will actually beat me. Poi being plus on whiff, I'm like, maybe I should uh, I should just not think like I'm a Street Fighter player. <laughs> don't get me wrong, Damascus, that, that move, it's wild. It's out here. It, it, I don't know if it's okay how it is. <laughs> because it's, it's one of those buttons where it demands you have resources to beat. Yeah. And that's really annoying because so has so many other things you have to look out for yeah and he gets a lot from this you know so like it it really installs a lot of pressure to anyone facing him now it's maka trying but he had to stop he still got burst to get away oh no that was a great backdash he knew it was coming he saw the vortex he was like nope not me not today it's not about that life oh 5k that seems like an interesting button maybe to throw out a little bit more but yeah, Soul gets a bit too close for comfort. That 5k is not going to do very well in close combat. Counter! Oh, no. Oh, you know what, C4? I would like to say something. I'm actually using a mod today, but I don't think anyone in the chat uh, noticed it. So I'll, 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 let, I'll, let, I'll let you guys in the chat uh, tell me if, if, you, if you see which mod we're using today. Yeah, <laughs> can I, I can it notice, but can, yeah. can deep is a cheater. Can deep cheating, but you know, I'll, let, I'll let the chat uh, figure out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Doesn't don't things look a little bit clearer, chat? <laughs> <laughs> things aren't being obscured by uh by things action, in the background. Uh, action looking clear. Actually yeah. doing 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 U UX development for <laughs> for art. <laughs> 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 We're doing out there. <laughs> there there yes, you go, you got it guys. It's the small counter. The combo go. counter does not go, go higher. It goes normal, like a normal fighting game, and normal things, and things no one ever asked for. We have normal numbers in the stream, and Maka gets his first game. <laughs> Maka gets a number. He gets a one. That's a start. Three one. Clean. He was he was using, he was fighting back. I think he was not so worried about fighting around Nifi and Soul. He was like, okay, look, I have to challenge you. I have to stop you. Your bonds are strong, but they're not invincible until you do the SDP. But everything else. <laughs> You got a hurt box. So Look at that massive Let me try ten. That. Eleven. Yeah, it's an eleven. It's okay. That's normal, guys. <laughs> Sesame Street mod. We can we can all count together with reasonable sized fonts. That's what we like. Oh my gosh, run up DP, keeping it old school, the rev style. Oof, classic. Nice DP. Gonna push him into the corner. Keep it again. He's tried again, but. Counter straight to the burst, very offensive burst. Niffy, oh my god, this button! Oh, okay. We've turned the momentum around. Now he's got Niffy in the corner. Obviously, has to look out for the SDP. No, you don't. You have to watch out for the revolver out of the corner. Niffy back to neutral, 5k. Wow, that's, that's not too bad. Yeah, not gonna kill just yet, but doing much more right now. 
to get this much movement by Nifi. He's just gonna get away Fujin. That's gonna be challenge. Oh no! He actually baited that gold burst. Could not punish it, but guess the throw. I feel like Nifi is like just four steps ahead constantly. <laughs> Pretty much. Pretty much. Uh, the, the strength of Soul is that he limits all of your, you know, reasonable answers. Yeah. And then Nifi just goes, oh, well, you can only do one or two things. So I'll just watch out for those. Uh, yeah. you, you're going to have to get real random to get out of this corner. Uh, you're going to have to take a lot of risks. Oh, uh, that's one of them. Sweeping the dragon punch. Good 6P. I like how he's not even challenging that first DP, knowing a second one might come. Ooh, the dust and another counter. Not converted, though, by Nifi. He's just going to keep the pressure on. And the anti air. You're not gonna burst just yet, but Maka in trouble in the corner. Maka tends to burst very late as well, so he, he generally only gets one burst per game. Yeah, he, he's playing like a mind game that I don't think Nifi's interested in. This is like playing chess with a pigeon. Like, Nifi's not trying to bait your bursts. If you hold your burst against someone who tries to bait you all the time, it makes perfect sense because they're gonna drop combos looking for it. But Nifi's so not concerned in your burst. <laughs> he doesn't care. just doesn't care. Like, I'm playing my game. You want a burst? Cool. That's, that's a resource you wasted. I'm yeah, I'm down. <laughs> there's, there's no mind game in Maka holding on to it. Oh my gosh, the backdash on the run up throw. Ooh. And he's in this right hand corner once again. Maka, I know he's not old enough, but he's going to have to start paying rent for this place. Go burst, <laughs> get some bar. Nice. I'm going to try to set him all the way to the corner, maybe to get some... Schmixturization! Ooh, not converted. The butterfly hit, but Maka was a bit too far to get anything. Counter, can I get a juggle? No. A bit too far, you know what? There we go! Electronic sports! Yep. Yep. Unfortunately, Maka there showing his uh his tofu. Because it's not me. That was definitely tofu. You can't you can't be running up on people, especially someone like Soul with Mealer's DP. Someone like me, if he's willing to backdash, you've got to keep your your setups real, no tofu. Well, let's see, for now it's Maka straight to the corner. He's home. Give him the key. <laughs> Give him the key. He, he, he has spent a lot of time in the corner. And look at this, my man is running through the stage like we're playing a 2D platformer. You only have to go towards the right. You don't go back. And you get the pressure on. And Nifi once again, dominance. Yeah, he, he's exploiting all the gaps that Angie has with the SDP. Uh, I'm not sure if Angie has a way to bait the SDP from uh, Fujin. I don't know if he can do something to block in time. That's yeah. that's the issue. I, I feel like even if he was maybe the one when you jump and throw the fan, right? That might at mm. least make it whiff, but but that's it. He's just making it whiff. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I think that does work mid-screen. In the corner, he gets clipped for sure. Yeah. I know that, but... Yeah. I mean, this is another way to do it. Just get the hits. Amazing. Pretty standard Damascus, right? Just, just get the hits. Exactly. Do damage. Counter! Again, exploiting the gap in the Fujin. Yeah, it's not that tough. If you cannot apply Fujin at all... Fujin is already not the, the, the absolute best pressure tool in the game, right? It has openings. Uh, but this way, against Soul, it's, it's a good luck. Yeah. Nice. Okay, and that's a good way to establish the Fujin mix, but it, it requires some butterflies. It requires nature. Yeah. So Mac is going to have to get the throw. Oh, put some nature. One. Backdash. This is a good start. Nifi only now just has his burst. Is he going to look for it? No, he's going to wake up throw. Why not? Jeez. Why would you do that? You got... <sighs> and Nifi is really I mean, trying was... to bait that burst, but there is no burst coming out and I don't care at all. 5k, Nifi, 6-1 for him. One game away from another Brazil. For today, this is a rough day. Yeah, this is a. Uh, this is hard. This is something we're gonna have to deal with. Soul being at the top. Oh, can I hit Fujin? Instant burst there. Okay, if he doesn't commit to a DP after the uh, the, the fan backdash. <laughs> oh, counter! Oh no. Gonna put him in the corner, trying to go for Fujin. Double Fujin there. And can't do anything due to the PRC. Nifi's defense still looking solid, and now he's just moving forwards. Maka's trying to escape, but can't find a way to get it to get out. Yeah, I feel there's like there's a couple of ways you can fight Soul. None of them are very, you know, good. <laughs> this is hard. Yeah. But one thing you can do is stay inside ah. of uh 
forward S range. So you can ID over when he does uh, gun fling because you can punish that as yeah. a counter hit state. So I don't know if maybe Mac is trying to mix up with the options and present some other threats to Nefi, but he has got a round here. So this is a good start. Did that cross up? Please tell me that didn't cross up. <laughs> I hope it does not. <laughs> I hope it does not. All right. Another Fujin. And as soon as, as Nifi sees those Fujin, it's immediately a PRC out and keeps the corner pressure. And that's actually really smart because not only does he give no momentum at all to Angie, he also keeps his own momentum. He forces Angie in the corner, no resources. Yeah. Okay, this is pushing him again. And he tried he tried to just 6P, bro, but not, not yet. <laughs> he definitely tried to 6P, bro. It. Oh, he doesn't get the P into 6H combo. Good. Match points. Matusho point two. Man like Nifi works in London Underground, protecting all the gaps. If you show him one, he's gonna drag a punch straight through it, making it very hard for Angie to get anything started. Like the, you were saying earlier, Damascus. Like when you shut down Fujin like that, you just DP in every gap. What does oh, this guy do? Oh no! Oh no! C4. Not oh, like this. Stop. One touchy. Maka! Oh, forest! It happened again!